You know, as adults, we sometimes tend to skip the milk and grab the coffee instead, and it's usually on the go. And in order to slow down and reconnect in today's fast-paced lifestyle, the California Milk Processor Board, creators of the iconic Got Milk campaign, well, they're introducing us to the relaxed island culture of Cuba, where they sure know how to make a great cup of coffee and enjoy it with family and friends. And here to introduce us to three Cuban coffee-inspired recipes is Eddie Zamora, creator mm -hmm. of Yum. Yum Yum Foodie. Eddie, yes. how are you? I am good. Good. Yeah, I'm well, golden. Of course, you're always drinking coffee. Pretty Why much. would you not be good? <laughs> I'm shot out of a cannon. Yeah, would be the term. yeah. exactly. <laughs> All right, first of all, let's uh, let's talk a little bit about yourself. Sure. You're from Miami. Born and raised, yeah. And and you have, is it is it a website, a, a TV show, Yum Yum Foodie? It's the a Yum blog. Yum Foodie. The Yum Yum Foodie is a blog, and of course, I create video content as well, and a bunch of stuff on social media at mm -hmm. the Yum Yum Foodie. Okay, yeah. and what can people expect when they go to your website? Because I'm taking a look at some of the video, and it looks like you're showing pretty yummy recipes. Well, they can expect to see my hair perfectly combed over like in that uh, video. Uh, and they uh, can uh, also uh, expect to see some uh, fun recipes, a lot of food porn, because uh, people love seeing uh, dishes from different restaurants. So I'm always sharing my favorite dishes yeah. from around the world. Yeah, and I understand you travel a lot. Absolutely. So you, and we can come to you and ask you what restaurants we should go visit if mm -hmm. we're going to a certain um, place. Absolutely, yep. Yeah. That's what I love. I love sharing that, that kind of thing. People spend a, lot of, uh, spend a lot of money. They save a lot of money to go on vacation. It's always nice to be able to steer them yeah. in the right direction. That's fantastic yeah. that you do that. Okay, let's talk milk now because really so, that's what we're here for. What are we making uh, first off? So what we have on the left here, I call this one the Euro Cuban. Okay. European because, of course, it's got Nutella in it, which is... Love Nutella. Yeah. No, I think I could have a, a Nutella IV at some point <laughs> in my life. I would be, I'd be good to go. Uh -huh. And a little bit of, of course, whole milk, a little bit of evaporated milk, and then that is a little espresso powder. So Cuban coffee, okay. you mix those guys well, you make the coffee, of course, okay. which we have right here. So you make the coffee with the espresso? Mm -hmm. Okay, Stoke so this is espresso. Espr exactly, yeah, I took okay. the liberty of making a little espresso ahead of time. Okay, perfect. And then I've mixed together my milk, my Nutella, mm -hmm. some shaved chocolate, okay? okay? A little bit of sugar to taste, because everybody's palate for sweetness is a little bit different. Yeah, yeah. And then always a pinch of salt, which is what my grandmother would do, because that actually brings out the sweetness and it, wow. it changes your palate. Okay. And then stovetop, whisk it all together. Well, you whisk the Nutella in there with the Absolutely. evaporated milk? Yeah, that, all wow. of it all together in the same pot. So it's actually, it's really easy to do. Okay. Just okay. to obviously keep an eye on it. That you don't want it really to boil, good. right? Mm -hmm. So uh, whisk those guys all together. And the Nutella, you want it to get nice and creamy and mixed in because the milk is already creamy. Mm -hmm. The chocolate's going to melt in. And if the Nutella doesn't melt in, it's going to be clumpy. You don't want that. So we get that all whisked in. Mm -hmm. Of course, I put a little bit of coffee in here, a little espresso, a little Cuban coffee, you know. Just to get the I, day going, I, well, even though coffee, it is what time. Fumble. I know, right? <laughs> <laughs> we can have a coffee anytime. Oh, fumble. That's okay. It's that's okay. It's yeah. Works. I wonder if we have a towel that down here. We do. Well, we we'll get. Oh, there we right. go. Look at that. It's magic. Um, so, so, so you're mixing the two together. Yeah, I mix the two wow. together. So, essentially, as if you were making a mocha or a so hot good. chocolate. Mm -hmm. And got it. Yeah, of course. Okay, can I taste it real quick? Because I'm dying. Yeah, I want you okay, to. Okay, gotcha. Yes, please. Because I love Nutella. Oh my goodness. And the, and make the chocolate. Mm -hmm. Now what kind of chocolate? So did you I, put use, in here? I use a, a semi-sweet chocolate because I don't want it to get too 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 sweet. I want the you know the coffee to kind of be showcased in there. I don't want you to forget that there's coffee yeah. mixed in there, but also the Nutella. So you don't want it to overpower that. So like a semi-sweet chocolate works really well. I love, really love, well love that, that. I love it. Okay, so our second recipe yes. is um, um, a different type of coffee, but it also different. involves chocolate, right? Yes. Okay. So I named this one the Kukui repellent. So uh, the boogeyman. Or oh, the, the Latin Kukui, boogeyman. Yeah. <laughs> um, yes, yes. So, of course, we have our espresso. So I'm going to add that in here already just because okay. why not? Um, so we have our little espresso at the bottom. Mm -hmm. And then, similar... Uh, to the predecessor, we've got milk, we've got a little bit of evaporated milk, okay. the shaved chocolate, okay. but now we've taken another a step further. We've got cinnamon sugar and we rim the glass. Okay? Wow. Hold on. Okay. But then what, what's going to get rid of the boogeyman? Spice. Spice. Yes. So I have some cayenne pepper that I threw in there, and again, I like it extra wow. spicy. So you can really kind of spice it up and mix it in the same way you're going to whisk it together, make that yeah. hot chocolate, and of course, if it's for kids, eliminate the espresso. Yes. Yeah. Oh, that is so cool. I, I can't even imagine cayenne pepper, but we're going to taste it right now, yes. aren't we? Okay. So while he pours it up, we're going to go to break, but we will be back with more Cuban-inspired coffee recipes. So stick around, everybody. Got milk. Got milk.